Junction diode. Properties and uses. Formation of the PN junction. The P-type semiconductor has an excess number of holes. Therefore, holes are the majority carriers of charge in P-type semiconductors, as shown. Similarly, N-type semiconductors has an excess number of electrons. Therefore, electrons are the majority carriers of charge in N-type semiconductors, as shown. The combination of P-type and N-type semiconductors results in a junction. This combination has many applications in electronic devices. When a P-type semiconductor is suitably joined to an N-type semiconductor, a contact is established between them and is called a P-N junction. Formation of depletion region. The P-N junction formed out of the P-type and N-type semiconductor separates P-type semiconductors from the N-type semiconductors. However, because of the contact, some of the electrons from the N side enter the P side. Similarly, some of the holes from the P side enter into the N side. So, at the junction, these electrons and holes combine with each other. The hole and electron neutralize each other on such recombination as shown. Therefore, in the region close to the junction, only negative ions are left behind on the P side and only positive ions on the N side. This results in the formation of a narrow charged region on either side of the PN junction. The N-type semiconductor close to the junction becomes positively charged, and the P-type semiconductor close to the junction becomes negatively charged. On either side of the junction, the region D becomes free from mobile charge carriers. That is to say, on the N-type side of D, no free electrons exist, and the P-type side of D, no holes exist. In the region of D, only immobile donor and acceptor ions exist. The region close to the PN junction is depleted of mobile charge carriers and is called the depletion region. Since on either side of the junction J, stationary positive and negative charges exist, there is an electric potential difference of VD between the edges of 1 and 2 of D. This potential difference VD across the junction is called the potential barrier as it prevents further movement of holes and electrons. This combination described becomes a PN junction diode.